But up first, breaking news in the high country as crews battle a growing wildfire northwest of Payson. It's called the Backbone Fire, and it's now forcing families out of their homes tonight. Anyone living in Strawberry, Pine, or Hunt Ranch needs to get out now. ADOT shut down several highways in the area, including State Route 87 from Payson to Lake Mary Road and State Route 260 between Camp Verde and State Route 87. The fire was first reported earlier this week after a thunderstorm rolled through. So far, it's burned more than 6,000 acres. Thanks everyone for joining us for 12 News at 10. I'm Mark Curtis. And I'm Tramai in for Cutty Bay Divine. The high country is on high alert tonight as the conditions of this wildfire change by the minute. We want to send things over to Team 12's Erica Stapleton. She joins us live from Payson. Erica, what's the latest? Hey guys, a lot of what you just said, 87 and 260, right on the edge of Payson here. That's where the roadblock is, so a lot of people can't get out that way. And all the people coming in, they're funneling here from Strawberry, Hunt Ranch, and also Pine, where those evacuation orders are in place. And that traffic is so slow because so many people are just trying to get away from that fire that is still burning. I want you to take a look right here now. We're outside the rodeo grounds, where a lot of people have actually brought their RVs, many of them coming over from the Walmart, where a lot of folks were originally staging. They're here for the night because they don't have anywhere else to go, forced out of their home, and a lot of them did not plan for anything like this. Fire rages as emotions take over. Oh my God, what do I take? What do I do? I just grab stuff like, you know, a few things. Sharon Allen grabbing those few things and her pups, Peaches and Bella, forced out of her home near Fossil Creek. I hope I have a house left, but you know. Snapping this photo on the way out of smoke caving in. Not good. She's one of hundreds of people evacuating from the Backbone Fire that jumped from 1,200 to 6,000 acres in a snap Friday afternoon. We just decided it was better to be safe than sorry. Amber Eiler's grateful to evacuate her entire hotel property, the Strawberry Inn, just in time. It's nothing we can control. As people push into Payson, they're finding lodging is all booked up. Many people camping out in RVs at the Walmart parking lot. That's where Sharon is waiting. A neighbor is bringing her her RV so she can head down to the valley to be with family already here by her side. They came up to help get me down there, you know, so thank God for family and kids. Praying the fire won't spread any further to her home of nearly two decades. We're going to get through this one way or another. So. For those people that are displaced, there are options for shelters like Rim Country Middle School or even here at the rodeo grounds. That's where RVs are staying and it's also a place people can bring livestock and animals. So keep that in mind if you do have to evacuate with more than just some people with you. And Gila County has been posting updates about this fire and also any updates to evacuation locations. So be sure to check them out on social media if you are in a position where you need some help. For now, we're live in Payson. Erica Stapleton, 12 News.